Hey everyone, <clears throat> teacher Rachel here. Uh, welcome to my class. And um, as you know, I've had this YouTube channel for quite a while. And what I've been doing is I've been um, uploading some vlogs or educational, um, educational lessons such as English for Cambodia. But lately I've been thinking of creating a video series where I teach um, English. Um, so I will be conducting this as if this is an online class, like I want it to be interactive and, uh, I want you to, uh, I'm making this actually for some of my, um, students who may be busy or, uh, but they may be busy. They want to have classes with me, but, uh, I may not have the time or, they, maybe they may also be busy and may not attend my classes so I want to um, I want to do this classes and post them on YouTube and uh, just pretend that we are having classes together and like if I ask you a question I will pause and I will wait for you to answer and yeah we'll see how it goes so um what I'll be using, uh, it's um, materials from a site that I've been subscribing to. It's called Off to Class. And um, I pay for this monthly. So, um, but I will be using these materials to teach my classes here. Um, so, I will show you their website in a bit. I will share my screen. So, not sure if you can see this screen, but this is the what um off to class offers so they have lessons from beginners um elementary pre-intermediate intermediate upper intermediate and advanced so we have we can start here from the very beginning step by step a0 for newcomers and these are their lessons so they have alphabets and letters numbers in class color shape and form uh, people, verbs, food and drink, all those things. So these are very basic lessons for A0 or for very new students. Um, then they also have the step-by-step -step curriculum, which is for beginners. So the beginners or beginner level is A1. And they have these the different themes all throughout. Okay, so I will start with the very first. Okay, and I will show you only a portion of the screen. Um, So, yes, I'm just adjusting the, so it will show only the, the lesson. Okay, so I hope you can see my um, entire screen. Um, okay, so we are at unit A, lesson one. Okay, so these are alphabets and letters. Uh, these are for newcomers or for adults who may not be familiar with the English alphabet yet. So the objective of this lesson is to introduce the alphabet. So at the end of the lesson, you will be able to understand the English alphabet. So it will introduce the standard, uh, the sounds of English uh, for newcomers who are learning at their own pace. Um, 
So this will provide an overview of the standard North American English pronunciation. Okay. Okay, so this is the alphabet. I will play the audio and I want you to listen, okay? So we have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. So just listen first. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay. So I will try to play it again while underlining. A, B, C, D, E, F. Okay. Sorry about that. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay. So that um, is just... It's just like an overview of all the alphabets. So, let me go to the next slide. So, listen again one more time. Okay. A, B, C, D, E, F. G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Okay. So in the English alphabet, we have, okay, we have 26 letters, okay? So I will be underlining the vowels. So we have five vowels. We have A, E, I, O, U. Okay. So in the English alphabet, when we say A, B, C, D, E, F, G, when we say that those are the letter names, remember? Those are the letter names. And we use the letter names when we are spelling. But when we are reading and when we are blending, we use the letter sounds. So for now, we're just going to go through the letter names again. Um, okay. So I'm going to underline each one. And I want you to repeat after me, okay? A. Okay, these are just the letter names, remember? Okay, only the names. A. A. B. B. C. C. D. D, E, E, F, F, G, G, H, H, I, I, J, J, K, K, L, L, M, M, N, N, 
O O P P Q Q R R S S T T U U V V W W X X Y Y Z Z Okay, one more time. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z All right Okay Let me stop Okay, so I hope that is clear to you. Those are the letter names. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. So we have twenty six letters in the english alphabet all right so listen and repeat okay a apple bag pizza b ball Bubble, bulb. Okay. So here we have the letter A, and the A makes the A ah sound, okay? So when I ask you what is the sound of the letter A, you say the, let the sound of the letter A is A, ah, A, ah, A ah for apple. A, A, apple. And then we have here the letter A in the middle of the word bag. B, ag, bag, bag. Now the letter A here is in the middle, okay? It's in the middle. So I'm not sure if you can see that. If this is the word bag, the letter A, the A sound is in the middle. A, A, B, A, G. And then we have pizza. Pizza. It's at the end of the word. A, pizza. Pizza. Apple. Bag. Pizza. And then we have the B sound. Ball. Ball. B, 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 ball. Again, what is the sound of the letter A? The sound of the letter A is A. Ah, A. Ah. Say it with me. A. Ah, A. Ah. Okay. Next, we have the letter B. The sound of the letter B is B. 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 Okay. B for ball. Ball. B, B, ball. And here the letter B or the B sound is in the middle, like the word bubble, bubble, bubble. 
Next, we have the B sound, but it's at the end of the word. Bulb. Bulb. Okay. Again, the letter A says A. Ah, A. Ah. And the letter B says B. B. Okay. So, this is going to be a bit of a long lesson. So, you don't have to finish watching the whole video uh, in one sitting, okay? So, you can just watch part of it and you can take a break. But if you want, you can finish the whole video because this will be a bit long. We have 15 slides. Okay, this is letter A and B. Next, we have letter C. Okay, this is the letter C, and this is the letter D, okay? Letter C, letter D. So first, let's listen to the audio, okay? And then we're going to, I want you to repeat after me. C, cat, abacus, attic. D. Dog. Candy. Red. Okay. So first we have the letter C. Again, that is the letter name. Okay. The letter name is C, but the sound is K, K, K for cat. K, K, cat. Okay. K, K, cat. Now, here we have the C in the middle of the word. Abacus. Abacus. K, K, abacus. And then we have K, K at the end of the word. Attic. Attic. K, K, attic. And then we have the letter D. The letter D says D. 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 And if it's in the beginning, okay. We say d, d, dog, d, d, dog. And we also have k, k, candy, k, k, candy, and r, r, candy. Oh, I'm sorry. We have d, d, okay. D, d, dog, d, d, can, candy, in the middle of the word, d, d, candy. And then we have d, d, red, red, okay? So again, k, k, cat, k, k, abacus, k, k, attic, okay? And then we have d, d, dog, d, d, candy, and d, d, red. So when we learn all of these letters, they show... The slides here show how we should say them in the in the beginning of the word, in the middle, or at the ending of the word, okay? Next, we have E-F-G, okay? E-F-G. Listen carefully. E. Egg. Bed. F, fish, 50, half, G, goat, sugar, frog, all right, so we have the letter E. Okay, the sound of the letter E is E, E, E as in egg, egg, and if it's in the middle, we say B, E, D, E, bed, bed, E, E, egg, E, E, bed, okay, like in the middle, the E sound in the middle. And then we have the letter F, okay, the letter F says F, F. For fish, f, f, fish, f, f, 
t the f in the middle of the word f fifty and h and f f for half half. Okay, that's the f sound f f f. Next, we have the letter G, and the sound of the letter G is G, G, as in goat, G, G, in the word, uh, in sugar, sugar, and G, G, as in frog, frog. So remember, it's in the, at the middle, uh, the beginning, the middle, and at the end. Again, what is the sound of the letter E? This, the letter E says... That's correct. Eh, eh. The short eh sound. And the F, what's the sound of letter F? Good job. It's f, f, f. How about the letter G? What's the sound of the letter G? That's right. It's g, g, g. Okay, so E, F, G. We have more letters to go, um, but please be patient, okay? Because these are very important. Uh, things to when we when we learn a new language we start from the very beginning we start from the letters and the sound so we will know how to read words okay next we have okay we have the letter h the letter h here says huh, 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 for hand and the huh, huh, huh in the word lighthouse lighthouse okay and here we have the letter I. We have the letter I, but this is the, the long I sound, the I, I sound as in island and light, okay? But usually, if this, the sound of the letter I is I, I, that's the short I sound, I, okay? And I'm going to type down I'm going to type down some words here. Uh, for example, we have the word igloo, iguana, okay, or inchworm. Those start with the short i sound, the i, i, i. Okay, those are the short i, but it's also important to learn the long i sound, which is in the word island and light. Okay, again, what's the sound of the letter H? The sound of the letter H is h, 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 and, and the sound of the letter I, the short i is i, i, as in igloo, iguana, inchworm, or the long i, which is island, in island, or the word light. Okay, so this is just a quick, it's just a crash crash course for all the alpha, the letters of the alphabet. Okay, next we have the letter J. The J, okay, I'm not going to play the audio anymore because I'm repeating it, I'm saying it anyway, so you can repeat after me. So J says J, J as in jam. J, j jam and in the mid uh the middle of the word j j in banjo b j j in banjo and we have the word uh, the letter k the letter k says k k k like the letter c but it's just k sound so k for key or in the middle here we we have jacket 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 and we have duck, k, k, duck, okay? Again, the letter J says j, j, j. And the letter K says k, k, k. Okay, I hope you remember all of those. We're almost done. We have the letter L, L. Okay, and we have the letter M, M. The letter L says l, l, as in leaf, leaf, l, l in balloon, balloon, and l, l as in shell, shell. The letter L says l, 
l l and we have the letter m the letter m says m m m mouse m m mouse or m, m in lemon lemon and m in jam jam okay so we can find the letter sounds in either in the beginning or the middle or at the end of the words okay so you have to be familiar with that next slide we're going to have letter n o n p all right so this is the letter n n is one two three the letter n says n n n n or n as in night, night, to na, na as in in the middle of the word here, we have to na and ban, ban. Okay, again, that's the n sound, n, n, n. And then we have the letter O. The letter O has the Ah oh, sound, ah, oh, ah, oh. but in this word it says ocean, so it can have the o oh sound as well, ocean. But usually it has the ah oh sound as in hot, hot, or you can say orange, orange, or octopus, ah, oh, ah, oh, octopus, okay? So then we have the letter P. The letter P says p, 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 as in pencil, p, p, pencil. P, p in shampoo in the middle shampoo the p sound and the p is in cap cap okay again the letter n says n n n and the letter o says a a or o o and then we have the letter p that says p p okay again n a All right, great job. And then we have the letter Q, R, and S, okay? This is the letter Q. It's like an O with a small line down there. So it's the letter Q. Q says qu, qu, qu. And the letter Q and U are always together, okay? Like in the word queen. Qua, qua, queen, qua, qua, queen, or qua, qua, as in equals, equals, two plus x equals one, like that, equals, qua, qua. Okay, so the sound of the letter Q is, that's right, qua, 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 okay? So it's good that we remember the letter names like A, B, C, D, but it's more important to remember the letter sounds because that's what you will use when you are reading or when you are blending. Okay, then we have the letter R. The letter R here says her, her, her as in rabbit, rabbit, pirate, pirate. Water, water, r, 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 okay. Then we have the letter S. The letter S says s, s, as in soap, s, s, soap, u, s, s, in listen, s, s, in listen, and s, s, as in yes, yes, okay. Again, the letter Q says qua, qua, qua. The letter R says r, r, r. And the letter S says s, s, s. Okay, again, what is the sound of the letter Q? That's right, it's qua, qua. Okay, when I ask you a question, remember to answer, okay? Because this will only be effective if you are interacting or answering my questions okay so just pretend i am uh in front of you the, the letter r says r, 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 okay and the letter s says s, s, s. okay okay next we have the letter 
T, U, and V. We're almost done with our 26 letters. Okay. So the letter T says T, T, T. The letter U says uh, 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 or, or U also. It says the U sound as well. And the letter V, okay, the letter V, it cannot see it well. It says V, 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 okay. So the letter T says T, T, T as in tiger, T, T in guitar, and T, T as in cat, okay. And then the letter U, it's, it can say unicorn. It can say the U sound as well, as in unicorn. Or it can also say uh, uh, as in Sunday, S, uh, n, sun day sunday and then we have the letter v that says v, v as in vet v v vet v v seven v v seven and v v in wave okay okay again what's the sound of the letter t the sound of the letter t is t t t the sound of the letter U is uh, 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 or U, U, U. Okay, and the sound of the letter V is V, V, V. Okay. So here we have the letter W. We have the W. The W says W, W, W as in web, web. W says W, W. Web or flower, flower. So the important thing is you can listen and hear the w w sound. X ray. I'm not so sure about this. I'd rather say box. Okay, because when you say box, you can hear the x x sound. Again, the sound of the letter X is x x x, as in box, box, box. This one is exit, exit. It's also the x, but you cannot really hear the x sound. It's like exit. But here the letter six ha has the x sound. Okay. X, x, six, six, six. Okay. Again, the letter W says w, w, w. And the letter X says x, x. Okay, we have um. Okay, we have two more slides left, and then our, our next slide is letter Y and Z. All right. So we have the letter Y. The letter Y says y y y as in yogurt y y yogurt, and we have y y kayak kayak. And we have the letter Z. The letter Z says Z, 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 as in zero, Z, Z, zero, or Z, Z in the word, in the lizard, the Z sound in the middle, lizard. Again, yogurt, kayak, zero, lizard. Y, the letter Y says Y, Y, Y. And the letter Z says Z. Z, Z. Okay. So our next slide will show the overview of the whole alphabet. Again. Okay, you can sing it to help you remember the uh, letter names. Okay, we can sing it together. And then we will go through the letter sounds because sounds are more important. Okay, you should remember the sounds more. So we have... A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Okay, so those are the letters' names. Now, let's say the letter sounds, okay? Say it with me. A, 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 A. B, 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 B. C, K, K, K. 
d d d d e e e e f f g g g g h h h i e e e j j j j k k k k l o o o m m m m n n n n o o o o p p p p q q q q r s T t t t u a a a or u u u v v v v w w w w x x x x y y y y z z z all right so those are the letters of the alphabet, okay? So we have 26 letters. We have five vowels and 21 consonants. So um, this course is, it can be for kids, it can be for adults, but I think this is mostly for adults because this is going very fast, 26 letters in just one lesson. But this is um, a crash course. Um, it means that uh, if you are old enough to understand, uh, this will just be easy for you and will be fast for you uh, because after that, we will have more um, lessons, okay? So let me stop sharing my screen. Okay, so those are the letters of the alphabet. Uh, thank you for joining my first lesson, and I hope you learned something from my lesson today. I will continue to be making more of these videos, and I will be trying to upload them um, every week, or if um, I'm not too busy, I will upload it more than, um, more than once a week, and yeah, I hope you guys learned something and I hope you will remember this lesson. So if you ever forget the um, this alphabet names or the sounds, you can go back and rewind and just try to listen again and again and uh, look at the examples and the words that we have. Um, so thank you for your time and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye.